Hello, ladies and gentlemen on Facebook. I thought I would、um, add this video because I saw there were some people asking about how to save a sketch scene in your personal library. And there are some folks that actually ask, why would you want to do this? Well, if you have a sketch scene that is probably maybe three or four slides, and that's your standard open, close, or some kind of standard scene that you're going to use over and over again, then why not save it instead of having to rebuild it or open up a project and then delete everything else around it?、Uh, so I, but the button is actually. Clear and in place, but if you're not paying attention, you might not know this is what it's for. And I really didn't until I went around trying all the buttons and everything else. I just wanted to know, you know, what happens if you do this. So, right here, so in the scene tab, which you're only going to see if you have a sketch scene, if you have any other scene, if you bring an animated slide in and you click on that slide, you don't see the scene tab. Okay. But if you go back to a scene where sketching happens, then you have the scene tab. And here in the scene tab is export scene. So if you click on the export scene, you can choose a category. I already created test. And then the scene name is going to be、uh, t shirt nine, because I've done at least seven or eight of these already. Save copy to collection, export zip pack. So if you actually had. A bunch of scenes that you want to share with yourself or your VA or whatever, you could actually export them to a zip file and then email that or pass it along or whatever you think you need to do. So once you put a scene name in here and create a category, I created, let me just create another one. Here is for t shirt scenes. Okay, so that's, that's my category. I would put this back to choose and let that sit there. Click on Start Export. And, oh yeah, the scene has been exported. Okay, so when you click on this button, you have this button here Add Sketch Scene from Personal Library. Click on the Personal Library button. Guess what? Under t shirts, there's that one. Under test, there's a different one. So if I clicked on the, let me click on the test since I just saved t shirts. Click on that and see what it did? It added that other test scene that I was playing around with earlier. This is the original one, remember? The t shirts. <clears throat> This is the test that I just brought in. So let me get rid of it. And again, what I can do is I can go here and, and add the t shirt scene so it'll end up being duplicated. So, as you can see, it's in here twice.、So、this allows you, if you create a set of scenes that you like and is working for you, you don't have to duplicate that over and over and over again. Just do it one time and save it in the personal scenes folder that you access through this button. And you save through this button. Hopefully, that helps someone out there. And also, I have my、um, how to zip and place your files in the Explain EO program folder coming up soon, so look for that one.